I just hope that God will answer our prayers. God's time is the best. It's better to wait for too long than to marry the wrong man. As for me, Pacha, I have to select the kind of man that I want to get He has to be rich, handsome, God's fearing. In fact, I have choice. Hey, <laughs> how bad, Pacha? Things don't really work the way you think, you know. I mustn't be that selective in as much as he can take care of me and my children and make me comfortable. I can actually work to support him. Exactly. The main point is praying that the good man comes our way. Remember, if you marry the wrong man, you're doomed for life. In fact, life will be so miserable for you. He that finds a wife, finds a good thing and obtains favor from the Lord. So let's just keep our faith on God. Thank you, girls, for choosing me to be your mentor. Huh? But the truth is that for you to be successful in life, you need a mentor. You need someone you can open up to, someone you can share your problems with, someone who can uphold you in prayers. Hmm? Um, I'm so happy. Thank you very much. Thank you once again for coming. You're welcome. Thank you. Thank very you. Much. Um, if you want to be under my mentorship, you must abide by my rules and regulations so that my prayers and my intercessions will work. I don't know if you're ready to do that. Yes, ma'am. Very ready. Okay. Number one, there will be no lies. You must tell me the truth at all times. No matter how bad or how dirty it is, always open up to me. Because when you tell me the truth, it will help me know what and how to channel my prayers. It will help me know the areas and how to talk to God on your behalf. So truth is important at all times. Hmm? Then secondly, commitment. We need to meet like three times in a week. So you choose the days and the time that suits you. And we we'll meet so that we'll be able to talk with each other, pray together. And um, I believe that there is no problem God cannot solve. Then, thirdly, you need to flee from fornication. Yes, you're surprised. Mm -hmm. You know, the Bible said that our body is a temple of the most high God and we should keep it holy and acceptable always. I am not saying you should not go out with your boyfriend. No, that is not what I'm saying. You are all due for marriage. What I'm saying is there should be no sex before marriage. Try as much as you can to abstain from sin so that it will not hinder our prayers, my prayers on your behalf. I hope you girls understand what I mean. Yes, ma. Yes, ma. We understand you. Thank you. Um, I don't know if you have any questions, but in the absence of none, um, I will soon close so that I will go and pick my children from school. No question, ma. Thank you very much.
welcome and once again thank you very much thank you for finding me worthy to be your mentor i promise to do my best i promise to always uphold you in my prayers every minute and second of the day and i know that god almighty in whom i serve will see you all through Amen. Mm -hmm. Thank you very Thank much. You. Thank you. We are yeah, glad to have you, man. Thank you. <laughs>will she ask us to free from fornication? How are we going to take care of our men? How? My sister, I don't want to talk, Sha. That's why I had to just keep notes. Because I don't understand. Please, don't mind her, okay? She's claiming to be too religious. We are sinners. Keep religion out of this. The real fact remains that sex can never keep a man. Then what we keep them? How then do we develop feelings for our so-called men? Angel, please, calm down. Let me ask her. Madam Holly, please, can you educate us on this? How are we going to keep our men? I don't know. Oh. But I think prayer can. <laughs> prayer does, yes. Prayer. prayer. Look how we is talking about prayer. <laughs> do you know how to pray? Can you say Psalm 35? Can you? You know I pray often these days. Well, anyways, talking about what Mrs. Love said, babes, I think the best thing would be to talk these things out with our men. In as much as we've been doing it with them before, can just stop for now till, till after marriage. I think you are right. <laughs> Like, we start from kissing, romancing, touching, you know all this. <laughs> yes. <laughs> we can do that without sex. Don't even go there. It's not all men that can hold their sex like that. Please, I think I am done with this discussion. Look at who is talking. See, Jessica, I am waiting for that righteous man that will come and ask for your hand on you. See, even the pastors. The pastors want to see how strong their wife will be on bed. Yes. Not all this weekly. Oh. Don't worry. I'll surprise you guys. You <laughs> 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 Let's get a change your mindset. That would myself. Don't Tasha, please. Tasha, please forgive me. Forgive you? You said I should forgive you. George, what is it that I don't do for you in this relationship? I cook for you. I wash your clothes. I give you sex almost every day, George. And now you are telling me that you are getting married to another woman. Why? Why, George? Why? Tasha, please understand me. <laughs> I can't believe this. Oh, I can't believe this. Please, just forgive me. Please, I am so sorry. George... Okay, fine. Tell me, what is so special about her? I need to know. There's nothing special about this girl, Tasha. We've not even had sex since we met each other. And when it comes to that, you were the best for me. But just that this girl, she, she's focused. You will surely meet a man that will love you the way you are. A man that will take care of you so much. Oh God! I can't believe this! George, please. Please, George. 
please don't do this to me, please. Please, George, please. Please, find a place in your heart to forgive me. Please. Tasha, please. For the sake of the hard times, please. No, 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 no. Tasha. Tasha. Do it well now. Eh, Bikopa. Respect yourself and keep your head on, please. You know how we do it. <laughs> I know the other me around, but if not, I could just push you. <laughs> Sorry, man. See, please just move this side yeah. backwards a bit. So that... I, I said, shut up. <laughs> Sorry, man. Shut up and keep quiet. <laughs> Why are you crying? Can you imagine? He's getting married to another woman. Huh? <sighs> oh my god. Oh, That's very bad. Sorry. I gave him everything for this relationship. I do everything he asks me to do. Just to please him. Now, he left me for other. Jessica, please tell me. It's Have okay, I done wrong? Okay. I know you didn't do anything bad to him. It's okay. It's okay. Stop crying, please. What it's did okay. I do to him? Please talk to him. Tasha, Tasha, it's okay. You've done nothing wrong to him. Nothing, absolutely nothing wrong to him. Just wipe your tears, okay? Please, it's okay, girl. You have to put yourself together, okay? Why are men like this? Stop crying. Stop crying. Stop crying. Stop crying. Nothing, nothing. God is in control. Oh. Mm -mm. Hey, what is the problem? Nothing, I'm fine. <laughs> Baby, I have a request to make. A request? Okay, I'm blessed. I no longer want sex before marriage. Why? Don't I satisfy you? You do. But it's actually a personal decision. Hey, come on. Honey, you promised to do anything for me. Come on. You said you love me, right? If you love me like you said, you have to grant my request. Okay. Okay. I've heard you, but can't we at least kiss your mouth, you know, those? You know. Look at you. So, okay, no problem. That's fine. Once it's only to sex. Baby, I love you. <laughs> Thank you. Now go <laughs> right behind you. <laughs> Baby, <laughs> why the sudden change of mind? Why? Change is constant, you know. Baby, I know. Change is fine. Change is constant, I know. But we've been doing this. Not the first time. Not the second time. Not the third time. Baby, for... And I want it to stop. Yes. I want it to stop. But now, 
Come on now, baby Makawai. Baby, okay. Baby, it is better you deny me food and give me this. At least, I'll be okay as a man that I am. Then it's a quit. Now it's a quit. Cool. So sex is the only reason why you love me, eh? In fact, this relationship has to end. Uh -huh. No, 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 no. It has not gotten to that. I swear to God. But, hey God. Baby, how can I love you because of sex? But my angel, at a time, to need to reason it now, as a man that I am, once in a while, in your palm, in tinier, I am married. No! I said no. Not even touch. Not even a touch. <sighs> yeah, now, brother, let me go near now. Not even a touch. <sighs> okay. Okay, we're going now. It's fine. It's fine. That's better. Hey. Meet me in the sitting room. She can't even consider. See how my body is boiling with the heat. Hey! Hey! Meet you in the sitting room. Okay now. <laughs> well, mine went well. Wow. Sing with me. Yeah. <laughs> I am happy for you, girls. <laughs> Look at me. I am single and heartbroken. <laughs> See who is talking. You that men rush like lottery. <laughs> Tomorrow now you see another guy knocking. Mm -hmm. We are not competing with you. Hmm? I know you very well. You not a lady. We just learn work for your hand. I need a sincere man. And that you will get. If only you can forget about that loser. Exactly. And start going out so that you can meet new people. It's not magic, girlfriend. <laughs> Thank you, babes. Thank you. Um, tomorrow is Friday, right? Yeah. I think we need to meet up with Mrs. Love for ladies' talk. It's true. Yeah. You're right. Okay, till tomorrow. Now. I am happy for this great stuff you girls too. Hmm? Always be in charge of your relationships. Yes. Any relationship you find yourself in, always tell the guy in question to define it. I'm telling you, most relationships out there does not have definition. They indulge in sex. They turn the girl in question to their housemate. She cooks, wash, clean. She does every chores in that house. And at the end of the day, she ends up with a heartbreak. Hmm. Tasha, don't worry, okay? Wipe your tears. I know that your man is somewhere. He is close. Thank you, ma'am. You're welcome. You see, the truth is that no man wants to get married to a woman who has done several abortions for him. Yes, because that same man in question wants to have children in that said marriage. So men are very careful when it comes to choosing a wife. I will advise you girls to get some Christian books. Christian videos, audios, listen to them. Build yourself more and stronger in the word of God. It will help you. 
It will help you stand your feet. It will help you know when to say yes and no to the devil. And don't forget that I will always uphold you in my prayers. And you too should also pray without ceasing. Don't be tired of praying. There is nothing God cannot do. Hmm? One thing is getting married. Another thing is staying in that marriage. If you're desperate, if you want to marry because your friends or your colleagues are unmarried, you will end up getting married to the wrong person. And trust me, you will be frustrated all the days of your life. And I do not wish that for any of you. So please, you need to be careful. Ask God to direct you to your own man. The Bible said the bone of our bone and the flesh of our flesh. Every woman has her own man. Pray that God will direct you to that your better half and you will stay happily ever after marriage. Mm? Do you understand? Yes, ma'am. Thank you. Let us pray. Um, I want to read the portion of the Bible to you. I hope you girls are enjoying the food. Yeah. <laughs> no, I like food. I nice. know. <laughs> no. Guess what? What? Guess! I cannot, I cannot guess. Who does? Okay. I have a date. Huh? Eh? Wow. I met him at the boutique yesterday. <laughs> I talk him. This girl. <laughs> wow, I'm so happy for you, girlfriend. Hey. I'm not talking. <laughs> We did learn work for this girl. I'm huh? telling you. We did learn you. you. you bad I'm so happy for you, hey. girlfriend. Oh, thank you. Wow. Thank you. Thank you. Let's say that again. Hmm. Please, I can't wait to hear the outcome of this date mm -hmm. and celebrate with you. Sure. It is going to turn out good. As long as you girls are eating my food. Okay. This nonsense food. Not even, not even mineral. Uh, okay, don't worry. I will take you girls now. Just manage this one. <laughs> oh, better. Anyway, darling, congratulations, congratulations in our Thank you. 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 Jesus name, Amen. In the mighty name of our Lord Jesus, Father Lord, I thank you for today. As I'm about to go out, Lord, lead me to the right people. Make me to meet important people. Yes, people that will love, man that will love and cherish me for who I am. God, please, I don't want any other woman. God, please, I am begging you. I am begging you to give me my own man. I need my own man. As I'm going... I've heard what you said. Yes? You want us to become friends. I have this question for you. Go on and ask me. Joma Juju, I want to answer. What kind of friend are we talking about here? Ah, uh, uh, fine girl. Why the country as if you know that stand with in the talk? You come my house, I come your own. We know each other more better. Feel ourselves, feel good. Not just eat, feel good. Have fun together. Feel each other. 
Don't tell me you're pretending. I don't get it. How? I did like say be small picking now. That's where our mama and our papa do carry bonus. You know that style. You know, see, then they need to call the name in here. Mm, you are not serious. You are not serious. You mean you need me this night? Yes. Tonight? See, I have money to spend on you. Just make me feel happy, feel like a young guy. You called me out here to talk about how good you are in bed, right? Yes. Yes, so. See, let me tell you, baby, you are just talking as if you have not done it before. You be virgin. I be a person of it, give it thanksgiving. Just, you know. You are so disgusting. Huh? I hate you. See this fool, oh? See, so, hey, 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 hey. So, you come to eat my money, I don't want to give me that pomo. And the wrong boat they meet, so. You don't enter one chance. Let's have a nigga. Hmm. And the one chance you enter soon. So you won't come eat my money, no one give me that thing. You won't come chop money, go soon. Chassis. You don't enter wrong boat, I beg. Hmm. All right, it's got. They get out. Makes sense. Chassis. Man again in this world. What is all this? I can't take this anymore. No, no, I can't. This is too much for me. This is too much. This is too much for me. That's so? Yes. Okay. So, how did it go? All they want from me is sex. They want to sleep with me. I don't understand what is going on in this world. Does it mean that no man, no man can love you without involving sex? Tasha, is it not better they reveal their intentions than deceiving you? Hmm? One of my daughters was a victim of this same thing. She was in a relationship with her guy. She said she stood her ground that there will be no sex till after wedlock. Do you know what the guy did? Man, he went ahead and fixed a day for their traditional marriage. He paid her bride price and married her and took her home. She felt everything has been settled, so she was free with the man. He enjoyed her from morning till night the way he wanted. And at the end of the day, he zoomed off. Jesus. Yes. He abandoned her and walked out of the marriage. 
He told her never to look for him because he was done with her. That he has gotten everything and have enjoyed the way he wanted. So you see that some men can actually go to extreme in getting what they want in a woman. Hey, that man is very wicked. In fact, men are wicked. That is some men for you. Some. <laughs> um, Madam Love, what do I do? Because I don't want to be a victim. Mm. Tasha. Tasha, I think you need to start with your dressing. Because they say the way you dress is the way you are being addressed. Mm? Try to dress a little bit decent. Cut down on your makeup. All these artificial things, most times it doesn't help. It's good to be yourself. Be natural. There is beauty in your natural self. Every reasonable man out there wants to have his woman in her natural state. Hmm? Then secondly, you need to get something doing. Engage yourself in any handwork. Learn something, be busy. If you're industrious, definitely a man out there will come for you. A man who will value you. You know most men wouldn't want to have a woman who will be an ability to them. No. They need a woman who will come into a home and help them, no matter how little. So you need to start something. You need to start doing something. Be busy with yourself. Hmm? You are right, ma. Thank you so much. Thank you, ma. You're welcome. Your husband is very lucky to have you. Yes, he is. Uh, okay, uh, I'll be going now. Mm -hmm. So you can continue your prayers. Please, remember your prayers. I will. And also say me hi to your friends. I will. <laughs> Bye. See, girl, I like this one. Yeah, See, this, this is nice actually. It's really, let me show you the style of the fair. Look at it here. Can't you see? I prefer this one. For you? Or yes, for me. What do you think? Yeah, yeah, it would be it's nice. nice. Can't you see? See, 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 come and see. I've made the best choice. Like this girl, come and see this, this girl. This girl is very stubborn. Wait, no, 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 wait. Babes, babe. Babe. Not again. Tatcha, what is wrong with you? Eh? I've told you to calm down. God will bless you with a wonderful man, trust me. I believe. When two of you are getting married, I am so happy for you, girls. Yours is coming, girl. Trust me. Okay. Amen. Thank you. So, <laughs> girls, this is not the case here. See, I went to see Mrs. Love today. Mm -hmm. I met her crying. What? And I wanted to know why she was crying. She was like, she do cry whenever she prays. So, I don't get it. Hmm. Well, some women cry when they are praying. Mm -hmm. And they are very rare to find. That woman is such a nice woman. Very good woman. Look at what you girls are saying. So, I, I don't know when someone is happy or not. I said something is wrong with her. Something is bothering her. Yes. 
Thatcher, nothing is wrong with that woman. We all know she has a wonderful family. Yes. Yeah. So let's just assume she likes crying yes. while praying. I think she's right. If you say so, no problem. Um, girls, let me go and fish. Wait, you have to help us. No, in fact, you have to see my choice because I've already made my choice and I have made the best. I know, I am tired. Let me just go and call. No, 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 please make it quick. You, we know you have eyes or colors. <laughs> How are you? Come and help us choose. <laughs> <laughs> All right, you girl. You don't want to change. So um, let's continue. See the one I was showing. Uh, it will be nice on you because you know you need to cover up this books of yours and that my own will be so perfect on me because no, you know you know I have I know. <laughs> I already know I wait <laughs> so I actually made the right choice for you yeah okay so okay. allow me to choose for you this one will be nice on you okay for the first out yes, yes. Tasha! Tasha! Hello! Ah, hello, hello Jessica! Tasha! <laughs> Hi, friend! Baby, how have you been? How have you been? I'm fine. What's happening? We hardly see you these days. Look at you. You even go out without makeup. And you pray often these days. <clears throat> This is quite unlike you. Sometimes, you need to be alone and make out time to discover yourself. Why waiting for someone to come and marry me? I need to work on myself. I need to love myself, trust myself the more before trusting or accepting any other person because no man no man wants to marry a liability hmm. is that so? Mm -hmm. Tasha <laughs> hey I can't believe this is coming from you eh? I can't believe this Tasha you of all people <laughs> hey if this is coming from Tasha of all people then who am I? I should give my whole life to God. How? Uh, yes, sir. This is surprising. <laughs> you don't have to do my friend. Uh, see, I have to advise you, girls. Because you're my good friend. Yes. You need to be more prayerful. Because we will live all our lives praying for our loved ones, our husband, and our children. That is the change. Is that so? <laughs> wow. <laughs> One that shall never end, Tasha. Am I dreaming? I know you are not. <laughs> oh. Oh. Great. 
So, how did you enjoy the teachings today? It was awesome. Oh. Wow, that's good. <laughs> oh. Tasha, I want you to be my wife. Please. I want you to marry me. Our mission, mission on earth is to make sure that it's not happy. Our mission on earth is to bring in the wrong relationship and make men marry wrong Our mission on earth is to make sure men never discover their purpose, nor reach their destination in life. So how did you allow this to happen? Master, we did all we could. We even put fornication among them so that their purpose and destinies can be caged in our kingdom. But we are amazed. They are not prayerful. But however, they listen to whatever that woman says and they are obedient to her. Don't, Don't you know, know that, that everything has principle? Principle? We must, must obey rules and regulations regulation and regulation in a particular game. game. So, so you, you don't, don't need, need much, much prayer for that man. If not this woman that called herself their mentor to stand as an aide to this girl. Then, then who is our head? Are you trying to see that our marriage is lacking in peace? Our mission is to bring two young people together and that one. How do you then fail in this? My lord, we are deeply sorry. Please give us a second chance. Second chance is what I have If I will not give you a second chance, I will be in heaven. Master, please allow me to do this one. How do you tell to do this? I will make them to enjoy a few moments of their marriage and strike once they are pregnant. <laughs> I will surely make them prayerless and take their husbands 
attention away from them. So they will start looking for sexual satisfaction outside. Why, Why don't, don't you strike them with violence? My Lord Lucifer, remember we are warned from above not to touch those on food. Or rather, the allusions to their homes cause them barrenness and sorrow. So that the archangel shall bring their destiny to our end. That's the villain of I I will, I will give you all the powers, powers you need. As for those demons that are now weak, take them to where they belong. Make sure they kill the demons forever. Yes, my Lord Lucifer. God, I'm so happy for you. Thank you. Ah, ah, this is lovely. Uh, you see, I told you it's better to wait for too long than to make the wrong choice. Exactly. <laughs> see, Jessica, but it's not easy when you watch your mate getting married and no one is coming for you. <laughs> but thank God he helped me. Thank God. Baby, I'm so happy for you. Look at you. Ah, let me see that ring again. Ah, thank God. Baby, this calls for a celebration. Yes, okay. yes. So get up and get me something to drink. Okay, I would. <laughs> what about Angel? Angel is not feeling too fine. That's why I had to come alone. Yeah. My regards to her. It's okay. <laughs> let me get you something. Look at you. <laughs> Mrs. is to be. Yes. Uh -huh. <laughs> No, this can't happen. Can't you see that? When are you going to start working? Or do you want my kingdom to collapse? Do you want to get it ruined? No, my Lord Lucifer. I have mobilized my demons. And we are ready to take off. There is no time to waste. It's teaching time. Six nine. Go! So what? And so what I ask you? And so what? What do you expect me to do? Beg you for forgiveness? No way! Eh? I will not beg you! But I will not beg you! Yes! Yes! I, I mean it! Yes, when you found your own door and married your job in your chest, my feelings didn't matter to you anymore. Whatever it was I was going through never mattered to you. All you knew was your job, your job, and only your job. Look, Ifunanya. If you had behaved like this from the beginning of this time, I wouldn't have married you. Yes! I would have brought you out of this house. I tell you that. Do you know that you are an ungrateful idiot? Yes! I want to ask you. I gave you three beautiful children. Two boys and a girl. Yes! What else are you looking for? You're a woman outside. What else do you want? I'm asking you. Do you know that you are my grateful fool? You should be happy that I am even in your life. Because if not for me, you would have been in this street, roaming from one street to another. Shut, Shut up, you! Shut up! Shut up! Well, that's what I call pride. And you know, pride goes before a door. I am born. I married you into this house. Mm. I married you. Oh! You said, you are telling me now that because you are in my life, because you found a job for me. Yes! I do not, I cannot survive without you. No, no, right? You should be grateful. Okay. Yeah. Okay, now I understand you. You have a and job. Let now me, you want to go after me. Let me assure you that I do. I want you to open yourself. Just sit down, relax, and walk in. 
drama in your life now. Hey. Yes, from that. You are not going anywhere. Please, I said you are not going anywhere. Okay, you want me to leave you so that you will run into another woman's arms. No, 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 no. no. After giving you work, oh my leg, this woman's work. Leave me alone. I am not leaving you. Me you are going nowhere. Eh? Father, King of Kings, Jehovah Nisi, Jehovah Elohim, Father, I thank you for this beautiful day. I thank you for this beautiful morning. Lord God Almighty, I commit my husband unto your hands as he's about to go to work this morning. Guide and protect him. Father, Lord, let him be at the right place at the right time. Cover him with the blood of Jesus. All the activities of today, I come against any principalities and powers. In high places, wherever they are, I counsel in the name of our Lord Jesus. Thank you. Thank you, Jesus. Sweetheart. Sweetheart. Thank you. Um. I'm going to miss you. I will be so But you know one thing? Just take good care of yourself. Okay? I will. Okay? Mm -hmm. Let me rush up to you. Alright? You're going to take care of yourself, okay? I will see you. Alright, see you when I come back. See that? Is that? Are you forgetting something? Oh, 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 oh. Forgive me, my love. <laughs> I am sorry. You remember. <laughs> mm. Father, in the name of Jesus. Amen. In the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. I thank you for this wonderful gift. Amen. We thank you for this baby. Father, I thank you for this gift. I thank you. I thank you, Father. Father, I declare total help. I ask for divine help. Oh Lord, I commit my family into your hands. I commit my wife into your hands. I commit my baby into your hands. Father, I declare that my wife will deliver as the Hebrew woman in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. There shall be no complication in the name of Jesus. I cover her with the blood of Jesus. I cover the baby in the blood of Jesus. Father, we thank you because we know it is done. Amen. In the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. 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 Pray without season, without season, without season. Pray, pray without season. Wake up and pray. Hey, my friend, wake your money up to pray. The evil ones are all about to in you. And please wake up. Honey, look up, let's go. Honey! What? Please, honey. Honey, please, let's go. We need to pray now. Let's pray. In Jesus' name. I am standing in the rock of ages, the rock which never fails. I am standing on the rock of ages, the rock which never fails. The king of the other fishes. 
to hell by Pastor Peter. So this man is the strongest faith. One thing he does not know that he can cast out the mob, but he can kill it. Rest, my friend. I will send another Belia to the child. Some Christians don't maintain their prayer life. Rest, my friend. Sleeping by this hour, don't you know you have a word to give your members tomorrow? But that is not my mission. Please wake up and pray for your child and wife. The devil is planting an evil seed in her. Please wake up, please wake up, please wake up. Please wake up. I be sleeping when I am studying the word of God. The atmosphere is evil. I can perceive evil.
Little Angel, what is going on? I'm here to collect the report concerning the child. I want to leave, but I can't. The villagers have protected the child with stubbornness and seriousness, lazy and rice. The villagers have prayed with the child every night. The mother and father never pray for him or spill grace upon his life. Then why don't you strike the villagers? I'm sent to guide, not to fight. But if I receive instruction from the mother through prayers, then I have the right to fight for them. She wakes up so early, only to run to her business activities. She no longer prays the way she does before she got married. My little angel, pray without ceasing. If not, she will end up giving birth to this child and the child will bring nothing but pains to them. I wish they can train the child in the way of the Lord so that I can help find his salvation and restore all that the devil has taken from him. I wish you good luck on your mission. I got a revelation last night. <laughs> the devil is about destroying homes. They start from their children till their adulthood. Till when they are ready to get married and they will end up giving them the wrong spouse. But I thank God I married my wife. <laughs> I thank God I married my husband too. <laughs> there is a spirit called Belial. Their work is to torment the children, polluting their destinies, making them uncontrollable to their parents. God forbid. Not my own child. That is why you should not stop praying for the children. No matter how tired you are, the Belial operates during the midnight. You don't get tired. Many homes have no knowledge of this. Of course. What are the consequences? Sweetheart, they end up crashing homes. Turning the children to their mother against their father. Mothers support their children even when they do wrong. Children keep malice. Wives keeping malice to their husbands and deny them of sex, which forces them to go outside to seek for sexual satisfaction. They might even come back with a disease and affect the wife. God have mercy. Hey, see, I need to inform my friends about this. Yes, you need to. Yes. You need to. But we have to start from you first. Now let us pray. In the name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. Heavenly Father, King of glory, the El Shaddai Elohim and Adonai, the King of Glory, the I am that I am.
Oh, see. Please come and carry this thing. You're welcome, honey. Angel, I noticed something. Ever since this child came into this family, you seem not to be playing your role as a wife to her husband. Angel, you no longer cook for me. You no longer take care of my needs or take care of me at the due time. All because of this child. Well, Angel, let me ask you, let me ask you. If this child lies down for a minute, an hour, will she die? No, I am asking you, will she die? Please don't talk like this. This baby cries a lot. And he's still weak and fragile. He needs to give him motherly love and care. Motherly love and care. And choose away the love of a wife to her husband. No, I'm asking you. Angel, I must be honest with you. I am not happy. I am not happy about the whole thing that is going on in this house. And I must promise you, if you don't handle this, you won't like the outcome. In short, you know what? Angel, it is either you choose between this baby and I. Why are you talking like this? It's a baby you're talking about here. I thought we are in this together. Please don't say this. Really? You know what I think? You know what? Maybe we'll see about that. So have a think. Either I or this baby of yours. Looking sweet from you. How are you doing? I'm good. <laughs> You're looking so cute. Oh, really? I always do. <laughs> no, I missed you this. Yeah, but I'm here. Mm -hmm. I, I noticed you were cooking inside, so, so let me let go. Please, okay. when you're done. And now I'm done. <laughs> and I'm here. Oh, and I'm so happy <laughs> to see you. I missed everything. Yeah. You know what I'm talking about? <laughs> Oh. Oh. I'm sorry, I have to go. Wait, wait, wait. But mother is there to take care of me. You won't understand. This baby won't stop crying. And if I take long, he will develop fever. Oh. Please do this some other time, please. Please. Okay. Who is this baby? Anytime I'm with her, yeah, yeah. It's just not me born this Peking, so. Why is this Peking can't become my own enemy now? They send them. I don't understand. I don't understand. Wow. Yeah, yeah. Anytime I want to do something, this baby could be my enemy. I don't know. Oh. You're already tired. 
Just leave her safe child. Don't worry. Continue reading the word of God. You will be fine. You need some sleep for child's health. Besides, you can read the Bible anytime. My friend, don't allow your mother to sleep. Give drunk. It's just a matter of a second. You will sleep after reading the Bible. You need some sleep for child delivery so that you can come into the world and play with so many toys. So tired. I'm feeling so busy. No, I need to sleep. I'll wake up by 3 a.m. to pray. That which is beautiful and your aroused. Oh, what? You're not serious, are you? What? You're not serious, are you? So, you're cheating already. After just one child. Angel. Angel. Cheating? Angel. You are the one cheating in this marriage. Do not disturb my peace. Except if you want me to go back to where I'm coming from. So, there's a little child that always cries. Yeah, yeah. Hey, the grandma. Little, please. For once, I'll have peace in this house. Oh! Help me, Mrs. Love. My marriage is crashing. My husband... Wait. What is that on your face? Hmm? What's Mark? Okay. <laughs> My dear. It's nothing. You know, once in a while, we experience these things. Um, what did you say happened with your marriage? This mark. I know it when I see one. You know what? It's not an accident. And I know you can indulge in a fight. Mrs. Love. Tell me. Are you also having challenges in your marriage? Hmm? Challenges? No, never! How can I have challenges in my marriage? A mentor? No. <laughs> it's not possible. Yeah? It's just that um, something happened, you know, and one of those things is nothing serious. It's nothing serious. It's nothing serious. Yes. You know what? 
Never mind. I can take care of my problems. No, Angel. You came all the way from my office to look for me. Why don't you open up? Talk to me. That is why I am here. Let me know what the problem is and we'll sort it out. We'll find a way to handle it in your marriage. No. I can't talk to you. But I'll advise. You fix your marriage. While I go home and fix mine. That is what I'm talking about. Whenever I want to pray or study the Bible, he starts crying. And he would never stop, even when his grandma carries him. Now my husband is cheating on me. And he's not even hiding it, because he blames me for everything. You went to see Mrs. Love, right? Yes. What report did you get from your mother-in-law when you came back? My sister, to my greatest surprise, she said he was sleeping soundly since I left. And immediately I came back, he started crying. In my own case, my sisters, I feel so weak all the time. Especially when I want to pray or read the Bible. The worst is that I don't even pray for my husband anymore when he wants to go to work. And his business is not even moving fine again. I don't know what is happening though. In fact, this baby is making me feel so lazy. This is called Belia. And about Mrs. Love, don't you ever tell anybody about your marriage. Just that we've come a long way. Not even your family name. No marriage is perfect. All we need to do is to keep praying for our home. We need to pray for our husband, our unborn child, our relatives. Yes. This world and the people in it are bad. Yes, so bad. This world is very wicked. People in this world, everyone. They are all wicked. That is why we need to be prayerful. Jessica, I feel the same way you feel. Hmm? But my husband opened my eyes to see the demon behind this. And it's called Belia. I repeat, Belia. It destroys her. It makes our children to disrespect us. Even we, we mothers to disrespect our husband. So that is why we, we need to pray without ceasing. Yes. Read your Bible. I think you're right. I've heard of it in one um, CD plate I listened to some time ago, but I never took it seriously. See? We need to activate a place of prayers. As for me, I need to get my husband back on track before things get out of hand. Yes, you need to. She believes she made me who I am today because she found a job for me. Peter, my wife values her job more than her marriage. So tell me, tell me why I shouldn't cheat on her. What? But you used to have a happy home. What 
went wrong? <laughs> Happy home, indeed. Look, Peter, let me tell you. When I got married, I married a wife who used to be clean, caring, and very peaceful. But all that changed after she gave me three kids. What does she not do? She throws her panties in every corner of my bedroom. And wears one nightgown for what seems like forever. One nightgown every day. That's, that's not even sexy. And when I confront her, all I get is insult. What? I mean, why are women like this? Um, have you prayed about it? Pray. Did I hear you say pray? Look, everybody cannot be a pastor like you. Peter, if you must know, I am seeing a woman right now. Yes, I paid her house rent and I'm paying for her upkeeps. What? Rubbish. Prince! You are an evangelist! What are you talking about? That was before. That was before and not now. Look, let me tell you, Peter. As I speak to you now, I think I had married a woman I should be dating. And now I am dating a woman I should have married. Please, don't preach to me. Do not preach to me. Nonsense. Prince. Prince. He just walked out on me. What, what is happening? What is this world turning to? Please, before your son start crying, please. Well, I don't want you to keep cheating on me. Cheating on you? Angel, I have never cheated on you. Not even for once. What you always... I always say that to piss you off and to make you change as a woman that you are. Angel, I go out there to drink with the boys so as to cool off my head. Because I'm tired of this, you're nagging, you are cheating, and that man trying to deny me of my right. I'm tired of everything. Yes. God. So, what if I say no drinking again? Talking about the devil. Always. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come on. You know what? Go get your husband. That man is crying again. Go get him. Exactly what I'm doing right now. Getting my husband. Our son can cry to hell for all I care. Oh, really? So, back to our discussion. No drinking again. Okay. Yes, ma. No more drinking. But on one condition. You have to promise me that that man over there won't be denying me of my rights. Not even Kunji. Is that a promise? Yeah. That's my baby. Come on. Whatever you do, 
dressed up and gray In everything you do Stop and gray In whatever you do Stop and gray In everything you do Stop and gray Father, in the name of Jesus, moving about Almighty and most like of the most thing, God, I thank you for my life. I thank you for my family, and Lord. I thank you for the privilege to be alive in the land of the living. And to not King of glory, of this. I thank you for my child, God. I thank you for my husband. Every evil spirit, every satanic demon, principalities and powers, I come against you in the mighty name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Father, I cover my family with the blood of Jesus. I cover my child with the blood of Jesus. Blood of Jesus. I commit my home unto your care and turn again the glory. Father, receive all the glory. Receive all the honor. Majesty. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, my Lord. I give you glory. Holy Spirit, take control. Blessed be thy name. In the name of Jesus, I pray. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. In whatever you do, stop and pray. In everything you do, stop and pray. In everything you do, stop and pray. Thank you. What is going on here? Why is everywhere looking so organized and clean all of a sudden? Oh, you brought back the maid without informing me, right? No, I did not bring back the maid. I cleaned it myself. Why? I've resigned from work. You did what? Why? My husband, I am sorry I had to. I want to be a better me. I want to go back to the me you saw before you got married to me. I'm sorry. I'm sorry I resigned. Tell me, this is a setup, right? This is not real. No, it's not a setup. Please, let's stop all this. Your food is ready, and your betting water too is ready. Hmm? Why don't you come and get refreshed and eat? Come on! I am standing on the rock of ages. The rock which never fails I am standing on the rock of ages The rock which never fails Looking up to The other finisher of our faith is Jesus Christ Whatever is formed against the child of prosper Baby! Baby! Looking up to the other finisher of our faith he is Jesus Christ. It's a lie! You can see it yourself. Mr. Soka! I'm a winner. Mr. Soka! Oh my God! I am standing on the Rock of ages, the rock which never fails. I am standing on the rock of ages, the rock which never fails. Looking up to the other 
My baby, I speak life into you. I, I cover you and the name of the Lord of Jesus. Lord of Jesus, the rock Take me which what you're gonna never do. fails. Take good care of yourself and my baby. I am standing on the rock of ages. The rock which never fails. Looking up to the other finisher of our faith. To receive glory, honor, and power, and power for the was created. All things are for thy pleasure, they are and were created. Let us pray. We have come as a family to glorify your holy name, to thank you for the miracle of sleeping and waking up together. Father, we thank you for our family. We thank you for daddy. We bring him before your throne of grace this hour, O oh Lord. Thank you for making him the head of this home. Amen. Daddy at work, no evil will come near daddy. Amen. Father, Lord, King of glory, you will provide for him so that he will take care of us. I thank you for our children, O oh Lord, even when they go to school, that they will do better than their peers, O oh God. Amen. You will give them the wisdom, you will give them the grace, O oh God, to shine above their peers, O oh Lord, in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. Even me, O oh Lord, that is at home, I ask for your wisdom, your love, and your patience, O oh Lord, to take care of this home that you have given unto me, O oh Lord. For you said that if we agree as a family, that which we ask for shall be added unto us. That we have agreed as a family, and we ask that your spirit rest upon us this day in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Let's share the grace together. Lord Jesus Christ, the love of God. feel guilty for cheating on my wife. No matter what, I should have been patient and followed her up with love and prayers. I should have told her where she failed to meet up. I have to leave that girl and face my marriage because I'm also contributing in destroying her destiny. I cannot have peace in my own house. 
Thank you, Lord, for restoring my marriage. Thank you. Thank you, Lord. Thank you. Sorry, my law loses. But I am my agent. Paid you. Hmm. You did not pay. pay. You did, you did a, nice a nice job. job. Just, Just like you have heaven and hell. And hell. So, so it is, it is to the people in the world. Not, not everyone will go to heaven. Like my size hell. hell. Not, not everyone, everyone knows, knows about, about you. Go, go into your homes. homes. Cage, Cage your, your children's, children's destinies. Break, break marriages, marriages and, and bring back, back more, more tears, tears to me, me so that, so that I, will I will drink and be happy. happy. Yes, my Lord. I am standing on the rock of ages The rock which never fails I am standing on the rock of ages the rock which never fails Looking up to The other finisher of our faith He is Jesus Christ Whatever is formed against us shall not prosper I'm a winner Looking up to The other finisher of our faith he is Jesus Christ whatever is formed against us shall not prosper I'm a winner I am standing on the rock of ages the rock which never fails I am standing on the rock of ages The rock which never fails Looking up to The other finisher of our faith He is Jesus Christ Whatever is formed against us shall not prosper I'm a winner